Hello, and welcome to this tutorial, where we're going to show you how to add the Elias plugin for Unreal Engine 4. If you don't already have a plugins folder in your project folder, create one now. It should be on the same level as content and the uProject file. Then make sure to pick the matching version of your current Unreal project as the Elias plugin. Here, for example, we have created a project with Unreal 4.13, so let's take the Elias2 underscore UE4 inside the 413 folder and put it in the plugins folder. If you're using a C++ project, you may need to right click the U project and select Generate Visual Studio Project Files. For the plugin to load, an editor restart is required. Import an Elias Mepro file via the content browser. You will get an Elias project asset, and an accompanying Elias component blueprint for that project will be created alongside it. Note that you don't have to copy the MePro and audio files to your Unreal project folder before importing. The Elias component blueprint is used to control playback of that Elias project. The Elias component can be added to an actor in the world, or it can be created via a call to the Spawn Elias blueprint node. If the component's auto-activate property is true, it will immediately begin playback when its containing actor activates, or when it's created from a Spawn Elias node. You can call specific Elias functions such as play, stop, set level, etc. either within your Elias component blueprint or externally on a reference to it. If you're working with WAV files, the plugin will automatically compress them when cooking. The compression settings are defined by a value from 0 to 100, the same as for other Unreal Audio assets. For further details, please view the Elias UE4 plugin manual located in the documentation folder. Be sure to subscribe to keep yourself updated on our latest videos and tutorials. Thank you.